Hello again folks and welcome back to Let's Play Dungeons and Dragons Tactics. I'm your host, the Gamer Darius. Last we left off, we went over to Inui, Inui and saved them from all the werewolves by killing their Khan. Kind of wish I had still stayed a little bit longer and gotten a little bit more treasure because I am only 8,000 off from affording Spadunkus the best weapon that a longsword wielder could possibly want, the Vorpal Sword. So, I'm going to hope that returning to Mala's Tumulus, that we are going to be able to get the last remaining 8,000 that I need. Fight your way to the inner sanctum of the tomb and use the dragon staff to locate the dragon. We are four levels over leveled for this. I just wanted to point that out really quickly before I dive on in. Dive it on in. Hello. Ah, yes. This place. This, this lovely place. There we go. So, I'm gonna do my usual shtick. Such as forget to cast, uh, prepare spells that would be all but essential. But, you know, that's, that's neither here nor there. So, let's cast invisibility. Ability on the rogue this time and again uh, I'm gonna hope that any money that I make in this is going to be enough in order to make it so as things are good uh, another 555 flaming arrows and a potion of fox's cunning okay the flaming arrows should honestly be quite a bit I don't think if it's gonna be that much but it's it, it's gonna be amount an amount name rod um would it be too late to cast haste on all of us the answer is no everyone has haste now although I could honestly just wait for uh Hits turn more than likely to finish off the poor unfortunate souls that are up there. Who is up there? Two wolves and a dude. Are they worth a spell is the question. Actually, wait. Yeah. We'll have the two wolves taken in the face. <gasps> oh, wow. There's actually quite a few of them. Oh, how unfortunate you all are going to be in about five seconds. Alright, magic. Oh, that's only going to hit the wolves. Um, can I hit you two? Not at the same time, no. Uh, oh, I'm going to take care of that shaman guy. Screw that noise. Wow, that guy's actually pretty tough. He was able to take an entire blow. Alright. Let's tuck ourselves into the corner here so that the wolves can't flank me. Because now that my AC isn't, you know, 25, because some idiot gave his amulet over to Spadunkus, uh, it's going to be far harder... not hard, but it's going to be more difficult... To make it so I'm just like, ah, I can take a hit. I mean, I can take a hit. No, nope, not attack, move. You are essentially on recon duty, little lady. Are there two creatures right there? There's a skeleton right there. Okay. Uh, there's quite a few skeletons right there. All right. That's, that's also fantastic. Not exactly as planned. There's also a mummy, too. I swear to crap it. If I end up getting mummy rot, I'm going to punch myself square in the face. <sighs> okay. We're neutral aligned now, though. So, am I able to turn undead? Or am I... Tur turn undead creatures. So I guess in this they make it so as 
being neutral um, works like being good in that you can churn undead as opposed to command undead. Which makes sense. Uh, really only evil characters were able to do so in the first place. Are you seriously all going to be aiming at Pit? Okay, I don't know where that werewolf is going, but I don't like it. Oh man, he's not just a mummy. He's a mummy lord. He's the lord of the mummies. Okay, yeah, I can see waiting for the skeletons to be lame. Uh, I call party foul. How the hell do you think you're able to hit me, sir? Alright. Um... You, sir, have a crossbow. Why don't you use it on that guy? Just like that. Maybe a little bit more damage next time, though. Wow, seriously? Alright. This will be a little bit harder than I thought it was going to be. How much harder? I don't know. We'll see. Because I got spells to make people die. Disintegrate. Cold. No. Phantasmal killer. I don't think that'll work on undead. Ice Storm at least has a good chance of doing a lot of damage. But that's mostly because of, you know, bludgeoning damage included. That is not hitting that skeleton, is it? I don't think it is. Uh, let's go for there. Ice Storm. And then, of course, I forget the fact that the damage that the spell does is probably translated completely into ice. Which means the skeletons are immune to it. Because, of course, they are. Probably should have kept that guy alive, huh? Because he provides light. Why'd you walk over to me? No, 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 no. I I'm just here to loot stuff. Thank you. How much money is in that one? I saw like 68? I think I saw 68. Alright. Um, if I get into the thick of things over there, next turn I can cast a... I'm going to risk it. If I get into the thick of it over here, have everyone surround, get over by Talos, then maybe I can have them get churned. Now the only thing that sucks about uh, churning is that it's in almost entirely based around charisma, as far as I recollect. What is that spell? I don't like that spell. I saved it against it though, so suck it. Probably shouldn't taunt the guy that's called a mummy lord, huh? Oh man, you're all in such a perfect po position for great amounts of murder. Ha, ah, you missed. What should I cast there? Seems like a fireball would be the best uh, thing to cast at that exact place. Ooh, that actually hit. Um, reload. And screw honor, we're gonna shoot this guy in the back. Okay, and then we're gonna full attack him. Are you dead yet? Good. No. Uh, we're gonna move you here. And this is gonna suck forever. This is going to suck a lot for River. I don't... Yeah. Evade! Evade, woman! Holy crap, she did. Cool. 
Die. Oh, he's got 22. Eight, yeah, okay. Damage reduction. Yep, yep, yep. Should have at least power attacked. Uh, Bone Crusher. What? Plus two heavy mace. Neat. We're going to get you out of there so that we can cast more of the spells that make the people die. Um, we want you to go. Why can't you go that way? Is it werewolves? It's werewolves, isn't it? Uh, there's another treasure there. I love how, you know, terrible undead abominations all over the place. Mummies here, mummies there. I'm just like, I want the money. Okay, they're all just hanging next to River. It's kind of freaking me out. Like, they can sense her, but they can't see her. So they can't, they don't want to bother wasting an attack on her. It's weird. That's exactly what's going on. They're waiting for that moment when she's actually able to be seen. It's weird. Is that a ranged attack? I feel like I should be getting an attack of opportunity against him. <sighs> I swear I'll get a turn eventually. There we are. Reload. And now we're going to attack. Man, you're actually doing a pretty sufficient amount of damage, sir. It's kind of weird. Oh man, you actually got hit. With a 30 AC, sir. Alright, let's see if I can't get another well-placed fireball in and deal with most of these assholes. Boop. No, not there. Um, that deals with a werewolf. That deals with that raider guy. Yeah. They'll also get the mummy lord, too. Yes. I don't know what I'll save down there. What was that? Oh, another werewolf. Ha! That works out in my favor. As does this guy's death. Well, uh, destruction, because technically undead, so they can't die. You know what I'm saying. Okay. We're good, though. We're good. We're fine. We're fine. That guy punched me in the face, but we're fine. No. No, no, no. No. Resist the temptation of being able to one-shot kill the mummy who is down to 19 HP. You got things to open. And money to get. 50 gold pieces that time around. Alright. Uh, 36 HP? Yeah, initially my idea was just to have him run in and cast the turn, or turn undead. Doesn't seem like that's my plan anymore. Yep, that's the thing. Ooh, you know what be really great right now? Cleave. Am I going to get an opportunity to cleave? I don't know. Mummy. Amrod. Reload. <laughs> He's just having a small sniper duel with this guy over here. No particular reason. Alright. Uh, have you help out with this guy? Smite the evil. Nice. Oh, critical, of course. Um, Scorching Ray seems to be about the best spell I could cast out the these guys. At the moment, anyways. Oh, wow. He's not dead yet. Uh, let's move you forward. I probably should have probably... I probably should have done something about that werewolf down there instead. Oh well. Um, could cleave you, could cleave you, but let's cleave the mummy lord. Huzzah! 
Dead mummy. In turn. <laughs> so what do we got? Wand of Dispel Magic. That's nice, I guess. I've never really had to dispel magic in this game though, so... Unless they have, like, an actual purpose for dispelling magic, I'm just gonna sell that. Okay, I need to do a quick... Quick look over. I have not yet passed clairvoyance at all this particular dungeon, have I? I'll have her wait then. So I wonder just how bad of a state these guys are in. Also, I've got a silver mace, so that should help. Should. Ugh. Go figure, I drop his AC by three and suddenly he's being hit by everyone. Why did you switch to a spear? I think he saw the actual melee fight that's going on over there. It was like, yeah, I'm going to join him. Uh, reload. I don't know if I can kill this guy before he decides to move away. Come on. Man, couldn't get a crit that time. Uh, yeah. That's it. Yeah, this seems like another situation that's going to be solved by Pit. Pit going, what are you, what's taking you guys so long? God, you're blocking the way. You know what, guys? I got this. Just, just, I got this. Then everyone starts getting worried, like, oh god, what spells he casting? Um, he'll cast this one. I kind of like this freezing sphere spell. It's a shit ton of damage really suddenly, really fast. Uh, if I go in here, is that going to cause plot? I don't want to cause plot yet. Alright, let's have her move around a little bit. Get her a move in before we decide to stop anywhere. No, no treasure in there. I definitely remember this place though. We had to stand on the sigils to make it so as the thing does the thing. Yeah, that's a, that's the thing. So you're gonna You know what? Um you you stay right there. I got a clairvoyance spell to cast. I just wanna see what else is in here. You know, make sure that we're not just Wasting our time by... Oh. No, I already opened that one. Stupid. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah, I don't think there's any more treasure in here. That's fine. Uh, reload while you're at it. I guess what I'm gonna have Spadunkus run on in and be all like, huzzah! We're back here again. What are those standing stones? I don't know. Are they pointing us to a Theron? Why can't someone just leave a map for us? Maybe they did. Dun dun, mother freaking dun! Let's move over here and kill this nomad. <laughs> oh, gods. So, all right, got a thing, got a bunch of uh, standing stones, which I'm going to guess we all have to tap in order to make it go wooba 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 to do stuff. In turn, I'm, I'm going to have Spadunkus finish off that dude. Because let's face it, that dude is just kind of going to get in the way. I feel like that's a secret door of some sort. I would be wrong, because there's a lot of spikes on that door. Really? You were so good, game. You were so good not making it so as everything's all bad. I'm kind of amazed, really, that this game is running as smoothly as it suddenly is today. 
No, not use. We are moving again. We're gonna let Spadunkus have his fun. Of smiting the evil. We're also gonna have him go like that. And be all like, haha. And attack. Wow, okay, you got more hit points than you deserve, sir. Uh, can I still move and attack, or is this one of those situations where we're done now? No, I want you to attack the Nomad. Cannot target, damn it. Doop -doop. Use the voice. I think the Nomad is going to give us no experience anyways. It's just kind of bragging rights to be able to kill him at this point. I can't charge either. Dang it. Don't quite know where the hell it is that river's going right now. She's just kind of walking. Like la 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 la. If anything, she's going to be right back where she started and, ar and roughly around. So. Um. Use. I see some kind of glowing map on the floor. I'm glad one of us. Oh, there it is. If I read this right, we must return to Vinzaxi. We must return to Vinzaxi and head north. Then we'll find a dragon in a sacred place called Arahadam. Beyond the Morning Mountains. Well, at last we meet. Should I know who you are? You should. This is my realm. I am caught of these steps. You have trespassed on my domain and split the blood of, spilt the blood of my people. You have entered our most sacred place and defiled it. Now you must pay for your actions in blood. That's adorable. Um. How anticlimactic could I make this? Step in. That's how anticlimactic I could have made that. <laughs> Whew. Uh, fear me, for I shall rend you asunder. Oh, God. Oh, god damn it. One of those reasons that spellcasters are just... Just... You know, one of those things. Oh, man. Whew, that felt good. Alright, see if I can actually kill this guy now. God damn it. Freaking clerics, man. Oh, hey, he's a... Uh, uh, we've all got someone to kill here. Ah, come on. Come on, step forward. There we go. Alright. <laughs> Do you punks feel lucky? Because, uh, I assure you, you are not. Uh, this guy. And dead. <laughs> dead through cleave. I love cleave. Um, too bad I probably can't reach him, can I? I mean, it's it's clearly going to be more than a turn to get up there, but... Oh, man. Super awesome boss fight. Cleric just taps him with a harm spell. That's, uh, that's about how I expected things to go. I uh, wonder how I can deal out, deal with this guy over here. Movement, flame strike. Yeah, yeah, flame strike will do. Maybe. Um, flame strike is better here because it has a chance of being ineffective against river. Oh no, she didn't dodge. Whoops. I mean, she's still not seen, but still. And disintegrate.
Uh, anti-climax for the win. Oh, hey, we got enough gold for uh, a Vorpal Sword. We have defeated the Khan. The steps are safe again until a new Khan takes his place. At least for now, it is over. Not for us. We still have a quest to complete. Thurorn lies beyond the Morning Mountains. We will return to Vinzaxi and inform Lady Alia. Love how it's usually the two short people of the party that's conversing with one another. It's not save this for the rest of the class. Holy crap! Act three. So tell me, what have you learned? My lady, we know that our third one is the name of a dragon. It is a hi it is hiding in a place cave named Ahardum. Ahardum? Where is that? The other side of the Morning Mountains. Though I don't know exactly where. Then go there and hunt down this dragon. The danger is almost upon us. The third moon cycle is approaching. A Thurorn must be destroyed if we are to avoid annihilation. The mountains are dangerous. It is the place of monsters and the unliving. Few people go there anymore. But will you go? I will, if someone ha can guide me to a Howardum. The entry of the Morning Mountains is at the gates of Ford and Hinton God, uh, God damn it. The dwarves live there. Only they dare venture on or beneath the mountains. Perhaps they can guide you. Then guide me they better. Because otherwise I'm going to get lost. But oh, there's another adventure over here. Another one over here. Hail, travelers! Hail, dwarf. Let us pass the gates of Forhorngrim. I am the battlesmith of Forhorngrim, an acolyte of Morden. Excuse my plain speech, but you should not pass here. We are in a state of siege. Our gates are barred. Strangers are not permitted into Ingram. Not until they are proven... Not until they have proven themselves against the undead in the lower mines. If you can fight in your way into the labyrinth... And mend the great elevator that the undead have broken. You can open the lower road to Ingram. Do this and you will have earned more than safety. Otherwise, depart. Do not return. Well, that's fantastic. I, sorry, I was just completely surprised by that guy's face. Also, what's with this dark temple? An abandoned temple off the path to the west of Apple Inn is said to be the nest of evil from which no one returns. And of course, there's an adventure. Just west of the Thieves' Den at Apple Inn, a smashed temple harbors a great darkness. You know I have to go there. You know I have to go there and smash the darkness, right? I mean, I gotta get my alignment back up, you know, relatively good. All right. It is time, Spadunkus. It is time. We are going to the courts. We are selling your old freaking sword that I'm pretty sure has so many chips in it that it's ridiculous. And we are finally buying you. What do you so desire? I've, I've never given a player a Vorpal Sword. For good reason. One Vorpal Sword, please. Oh my god. The hit to my wallet. So, again, the big deal about Vorpal Swords is that if you roll a natural 20, or in this case, any critical hit, the target creature dies. Just straight up dead. Ugh. And this thing has such a weird name. Scrap. I don't, I don't get the name. You know what? I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna, I just, he's got a Vorpal Sword now. You can't mess with a Vorpal Sword wielder. But I am gonna sell some stuff. Because River got a random allotment of crap. Flaming arrows, potions of Fox's Cunning. Might 
keep the heavy maze for... Uh, yeah, sell that too. Might keep the heavy maze for... Um, Talos, god damn it. Why can't I think names right now? Party management, trade. Uh, where? Oh. Curse is over already on that side. Alright, so, heavy mace, plus two. Bam. So the morning star is silver, but it is still plus one. Right? There's only a plus one morning star. Bypasses, reduction of werewolves and vampires. Which is alright. But it also only does D8 plus. Yeah. I. Wow, what is wrong with my clicking right now? I also really need to check out what it is that this does. Both hands, sword breaker, place and backpack. Ow. No, no, no. Give him the heavy mace. And give him back his sword breaker shield. Dang it, that light shield would have been more. Oh well. Oh well. It's about all I can say. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to go ahead and call an episode here. I should probably save too. When we return, uh, we have two directions to go. One is clearly northwards to the gates of Forod, Forod Ingrin. Which I'm never going to say that full name right. So I'm just going to say Ingrin. Or to the Dark Temple where we're likely going to have to smash some evil, which I am totally all about right now. Ooh, this should be fun! So, thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers!